I really hate playing with my kid and it's something I'm I feel guilty admitting but it he's just so controlling of me and it's like everything I do he either destroys what I'm doing if I'm building Legos if I'm making a painting he just destroys it or he wants me to sort of improv and entertain him without engaging in the play itself. Let me ask you two questions. First, is this a new behavior? And two, does he also correct what you're doing, whether it's the words that you're saying or how you're moving um, a Lego figure? Yeah, so actually it's been since he was a baby and I noticed this because now I have a second son who does engage with baby toys and things that hang above him and can sort of interact and engage with things without me manipulating and moving it for him. So now I've been reflecting on the fact that my older son just never could play even as an infant. And yeah, he absolutely corrects my words, how I say things, where I move the figurine, um, how I set up the fort. It, it just feels like nothing I do is ever correct or right. Yeah, so what you're describing are two things that are often associated with pathologically demand avoidant children. One is passiv passivity as an infant or baby in terms of engagement. And the second is equalizing behavior, which is controlling behavior directed towards a safe person in order to get back to a place of nervous system safety when there's the perception of threat. And so often the controlling behavior comes out in safe settings, which is a play setting with you, the other safe nervous system. 